All right, welcome back. So many people are wondering, it's been so dry and hot, and the grass, what do we do with it? Do we turn the sprinklers on? We have no idea, so we have questions. So we brought in Tony Hahn with Swingle Laundry and Landscape Care. You're the man, thank you so much for coming in. Do you turn the sprinklers on right no. now? Okay. No, I no is the answer. Do not turn the sprinklers on. <laughs> okay. I would, uh, you know, pull the hose. Everything's got to be watered. Mm -hmm. And this is my favorite. This is the greatest uh, hose end sprinkler. Uh, but no, do not turn the sprinklers on. Okay. Yes. And if you turn the hose on, what happens if we get another deep freeze? Well, just make sure you disconnect it from okay. the house. That's that's the critical thing. Pay close attention to south and west facing exposures. Um, water, especially around large evergreen trees, too, because that we're in the danger zone. I am very concerned. I know. Very we concerned. really need some moisture. Yes. but. For right now we don't have it so let's work with what we have what did you take this sample of you know I took a I was poking around a little bit uh, around the backyard just to see how dry it is and there's not much moisture here okay so that's why it's real real critical I think the the chore for the weekend is going to be dragging the hose around uh, if you're not watering this weekend you are gonna have some some issues because last fall think about it last fall was extremely dry right and some people you know may not have watered back then right so if we go into the fall dry and then we go and now in spring right. it's dry again uh, I am very concerned what are the common mistakes that people make right now well I think you know <laughs> not watering number yeah. one and ignoring the, the large evergreen trees because if we have drought conditions are large evergreens like Colorado spruce and Austrian pine they're the ones that are going to be more susceptible to insect activity because okay. weaker trees uh, are more susceptible to, to insects so pay attention to the large evergreen trees it's like you're speaking to me right now because I have a few of those too <laughs> yeah yeah and, and again don't don't underestimate the value of watering and I can't you know I've been in Denver since 1982 and 1982 was a lot like this we had some warm temperatures mm -hmm. uh, but then again in April we had some cold snaps so be very careful with turning that sprinkler system on but I can't emphasize enough water 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 okay there it is. Bust out the hose this weekend, I guess, and don't turn the sprinklers on. Correct. He's the man to know. <laughs> Thank you, Tony. Really welcome. appreciate it. We're going to put all of your tips on our website Thanks. at 9news.com. Right. Amelia?